Hey, so we have the solar eclipse uh, coming up on August 21st, and this is going to be a total solar eclipse this time around. And this is being called as the Great American um, Eclipse because the fact that it's going to be predominantly over the U.S. and many parts of the U.S. are going to experience this total solar eclipse. Exciting! Now, this spectacle happens when the moon completely obstructs the sun. Now, amazing as this is going to be, with millions of people making special travel arrangements, hotel bookings, uh, parties, camping arrangements, uh, it's going to be a frenzy. Now, um, now, the path of the total eclipse, which is called the path of totality, is going to last about an hour and a half long. And if you are in Oregon, uh, it's going to begin for you at around 10, 16 a.m. and going to cross through Idaho, Wyoming, Montana, Nebraska, um, Iowa, Kansas, Missouri, uh, Illinois, Kentucky, uh, Tennessee, uh, Georgia, and then the North and South Carolina. And if you live in Carbondale, uh, Carbondale um, Illinois, you'll have the sun completely covered for about two minutes and 40 seconds. Now that's going to be the maximum uh, for, for anyone. And I actually know somebody who lives there. Anyways, apparently that is not me. Now about safety, uh, because that is the, should be the number one uh, priority. It is only safe to look at the eclipse or if uh, only when it is in the totality. Now, that means when the moon has completely obstructed the sun. Even then, got to be careful as when um, the sun is coming out of the totality that you should be wearing your goggles all the time. Now, there are special eclipse glasses. If you don't have them, then better be careful and avoid looking at the sun. If you wear the glasses, make sure you wear the solar filter over your uh, regular prescription uh, glasses. Now, don't try to look at the eclipse even uh, through your camera or your telescope and make sure you know what you're doing even if um, you are using a solar filter um, on top of your camera or your telescope and make sure you're not using any knockoff project, uh, product um, or any counterfeits um, solar filter and make sure that it is a tr it basically you know where it's coming from and you can verify that uh, these people are genuine. Well, if you don't have anything, you can make a pinhole camera. So uh, basically what you have to do is get a black card, um, get any cardboard box and open the cardboard box up from one end, uh, make a small pinhole in, um, in the black card, um, half the card between the sun and the cardboard box. And just you'll be able to see the eclipse happening on your cardboard box that's going to be pretty cheap and you're going to get um you're going to you're going to see the like, eclipse anyways safety is first and a solar eclipse is not something that you uh, should be missing out on but you got to do it safely all right all the best thank you so much